Two men shot in Mobile, one of them killed. Tonight, WKRG News 5's Jeremy Jones speaks with the brother of one of the victims, along with a woman who says she's had it with the violence in the port city. This is a problem that we need to address and address now. Another man killed in Mobile, this time on Brownlee Street. It's part of the reason why Nigel Hill became an activist and why she moved out of the port city. It's not a weekend go back. And it's, it's beyond ridiculous now. Hearing about the deadly shooting on Saturday on Brownlee Street brings Hill back to the night she lost her own son. It hurts my heart every time I see another mother that was just happy. Like, you, you really don't realize how blessed you are to wake up and look at your children. Mobile police investigators say two men were shot while sitting in a car around 9.30. It's heartbreaking, you know. Wendell Austin says his brother and the man killed, Montre Slater, were on their way to go have some fun, when instead they were both shot. Now his brother Greg Austin is in critical condition. It's been kind of hard for me to process it all right now. I just left the hospital checking on my brother. He just got out of surgery. While Austin says he has no plans to leave the city like Hill, He's worried about Mobile's future. If we could just stop and take a moment and find out what the problem is and come to a resolution, the world would be a much better place, man. Hill says while she may not live in the port city anymore, she'll keep pushing for peace. I mean, there's so many things that can be resolved by a conversation. In Mobile, Jeremy Jones, WKRG News 5.